Just because the weather is getting colder outside doesn't mean that you can't enjoy delicious smoothies. We just are going to use some seasonal fruits and warming spices and you're going to love it. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Katrina. Welcome back to the Organics channel where we gather together in the kitchen every week and we make delicious and seasonal recipes. Today, we're going to be making a heart healthy cranberry pomegranate smoothie. Let's begin today by adding one half of a cup of frozen cranberries to your high speed blender. Cranberries are anti-inflammatory, they are rich in antioxidants, and they may also help support a healthy heart. For our sweetener today, I'm going to add in one to two pitted and chopped up dates. Now you're certainly welcome to substitute this with one half of a banana or your preferred sweetener. One small peeled orange. So the benefit of using the entire orange instead of just the juice is that we're going to get the fiber and fiber is great for your digestion and may also help you feel full. One half of a cup of light coconut milk or your favorite milk. And this is going to add some lovely healthy fats. The other ingredient today that may help support a healthy heart is one half of a cup of unsweetened pomegranate juice. One tablespoon of hemp seeds, which contain healthy fat, protein, and fiber. One quarter teaspoon of brown ginger to warm up our smoothie a bit today. Our last ingredient today is optional, but highly recommended. I'm going to add in one scoop of our Organa Greens green juice powder that is rich in fermented and sprouted superfoods. If you wanted to add some more green to your smoothie, you could also add in a handful of organic spinach. Blend up all of your ingredients really well until you reach a nice, smooth consistency. Okay, let's give this heart healthy smoothie a taste. Oh, that's really nice. It's a little bit tart, but not too much. I love that. And the sweetness is perfect. I'm tasting the hemp seeds. It gives it a little bit of a nutty flavor. And I also love that most of my ingredients were at room temperature, so the smoothie's warmer. And especially as the weather gets colder, it's really nice to drink your smoothies this way. Also, when you're blending up your smoothie, let your blender run for a good minute. That will also help warm up all of the ingredients. Really good, give it a try. Thanks so much for being here today. We appreciate your support. Take great care of yourself this week, and I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.